Hey everybody, it's Sherry at The Crafty Decorator. Happy Thursday, everybody. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Okay, I am here at my son's house and I am doing my daughter-in-law's urns that I all told you about last night. So I wanna show you how we did them this year. Last year we did stacked pumpkins in them. This year she wanted a tree. So I found this tree um, at Bed Bath & Beyond. Bed Bath & Beyond. So, and we bought greens. I'm gonna show y'all how I did this. Um, but I wanna show you one done. So this is what it looks like. And let me bring this over and I will explain how I did this. Okay, these are her urns. We got these last year, I think at Michael's. I think I got these at Michael's. There, I have no dirt or anything in these. I got a styrofoam circle. I set my tree on top because it comes in a wooden box. So you could just set them like this on your porch if you want, but we want it height and pretty greenery around it. So it comes in a wooden box. So I placed this on the circle, I traced it. Then I cut it out. And then I slid my styrofoam into the urn. So it's looking like this. Then I take my box, tree box, and you're gonna set it in here. We don't want it real hot. So this is how we have them in there, like this. It runs on batteries. It's not a timer though. <laughs> That's the only bad thing. It's not a timer. Um, let me see this. The door popped open. The door popped open. Okay, so we have our tree in. Now we wanted, and it's looking a little crooked there. Ooh, straighten it out. Okay, we wanted it to have greenery around the bottom. We bought these at Hobby Lobby, these picks right here. They got the little berries on them. We got two different colors. I was gonna alternate and it didn't look very good. So, here's what we did. Spread one open. I'm putting the darker one on the bottom. Spread it open like this. Then spread this one open. Not many berries. And then place them, this one on the bottom, on top of each other. Place one on top of the other. Then I zip tie them together. I'll spread it out more when I put them in, but I'm using a four inch zip tie. So I zip tie them at the top here and then I zip tie them at the bottom. <laughs> zip ties in my pocket. Okay. And I just cut my little extra zip ties off. And then I bend it way up on top here way up on top, so like this. See it there? Then I just insert it, but I inserted them around and you were seeing too much white. So last year we used a magnolia wreath around the pumpkins. I went, we went and got the magnolia wreaths. I had to cut it so I can slide it around the tree. You couldn't, like, you couldn't drop it over the tree. So I had to cut it. Whoops. I'm gonna stick my ends here into the styrofoam. I just wanna make sure I get it straight. Okay. 
So we put the wreath around. Now we can stick our picks in there. I start with the front. So let's see if I say this is my front. I just stick my, my pick in close to the wooden base. And then spread out more. And you want to pull some leaves there. You want to pull some of the darker color up top. Okay, so there's our first one. I'm gonna put one around each side. So I already have these zip tied together. Just gonna bend it. And stick it in. That's looking. <laughs> Let's do this side.
Make sure you can get to your battery pack. <laughs> Is there not a timer? Okay, there we go. <laughs> there it is, guys. How pretty is it? I love the tree and all the colors. Fall, fall colors. You will see them on the porch later. Okay, I hope you like this urn. Thanks for joining me. Bye.